Our, our company is Hawaii's oldest jewelry oh, company, yeah. but the farm where these oysters are from is in the southern bay of Japan. So these are saltwater pearls. So you want to find an older oyster. The older, the better. They get lots of algae. The barnacles are good, but pick through them. But just whatever one really speaks to you um, is the way to do it. <laughs> I wanted us to choose. I wanted us to choose together. How do you know when they're older? Just like the rings on a tree, go for one. Like I like ones that have a lot of green, like algae, like kind of stain on the shell. And they can get really like, um, the shells are hard. So if they start cracking or getting really brittle along the edge, that's a good sign. I like okay. this one. See? <laughs> do you want me to take this one? No, I want, to, I want us to do it together. We're married now. Uh, okay. Congratulations. Did you get married just today? Yeah, no, Thursday. Thursday. Oh, on Thursday? Very nice. How cool. You want this okay. one or should I move? Um, and you could put a few on the tray just to get a real good oh, look at them. And then that one looks pretty oh, good yeah, too. I like this one too. Yeah, that's a, that's a hard that one. Is that the one? That definitely looks like one of them. <laughs> Take pictures. Okay, let's move around and see if you find something else you like. <laughs> Look at that one. This one, yeah, this one's pretty too. Put it here. Smaller though, right? Little bit, but it doesn't have to be the biggest one always. That one has more of the green, like, growth on the shell too, which is good. I like that. Yeah. I like the smaller ones. See, I'm a small girl with a big, big, brain. <laughs> big head, big brain. This one too, it's really nice. It's got a good like thickness to it. I know. Too. And that shell is really look at that. That's all cracked. Look at how badly cracked that. That pretty beat up. This is so cool. <laughs> That's why I like I like pearls because when I was a kid I, I used to be in the ocean a lot. Oh yeah? Okay. Yeah. So, do you have many pearls at home or I'm from Brazil, so okay. Rio. I okay. don't know about that. But I remember all the ocean things. Oh, that's so I remember cool. the little crabs, the yeah. white crabs coming from the sand. Oh, neat. <laughs> I remember the, um, we had something we, we used to call Agua Viva, which was uh, very transparent. And they, uh, you can the you see them, but if you yeah. touch your skin, you burn. Oh, my gosh. It's an algae. Oh. They're beautiful. Oh, my goodness. And I got to experience the scene, the ones that change the color, they get neon in really? the water. The whole water gets neon. Wow. That would be really awesome to see. Yeah, I saw But not that. to get burned. That's not good. Yeah. <laughs> and I, I never got burned. Oh, that's good. That's this good. This one looks good, too. Yeah, you got, oh, yeah, but half the gone. shell, that one's like completely busted in on half right there. I look, I see the greening stuff around. It, it. does. You can the even mother see. of pearl is really wearing. Yeah, that's an old oyster. That one's got a little bit of everything going on for sure. But isn't it amazing how the ocean produces no, this? Which one are you going to get? <laughs> you choose. Oh, oh okay. No. I'll put it this one. Makes it special. Makes it special. This one here's got golden. Yeah, the colors okay. on that one that are really gonna cool. That's going to be it. That'll then. be the winner. We'll choose together. All right. I help you place these ones back on down. Now, you have you traveled to Hawaii? Have either of you been we vacation? We are going to go one day. On the list. Okay. So what we do, this is a tradition, is a aloha, meaning hello and goodbye, that we welcome and celebrate your new pearl today. So Miss, you're going to hold your sticks one more time. And then, sir, you want to hold her hand for some luck, if you could switch over Hi, hands there. And so what we do is we're going to tap on the oyster three times. And after the third tap, we're all going to say aloha. You ready? Yeah. Here we go. One, two, three. Aloha. aloha. So let's see what you get and your color chart there so you can see all the pearl personalities, the special meanings. So when we open the oyster, um, right from inside you can see what's known as the mother of oh, pearl. Oh, isn't it beautiful? So this is what, can we keep that soon? With the bacteria, this part we do have to dispose of, but the color, con you know, the color contrast is just neat to see right from the opening. And your pearl was meant <gasps> to be love. for love. I mean, oh. that... And that, look at the size of that, you guys. Congratulations. Yes. Seven out of a hundred.
to find this pearl. So for the Japanese oyster, it's as rare as it gets too. So I'm gonna make sure there's only one in there, but there is no more room in here besides how that, that's like bowling ball. That's the biggest one we have seen today. So wait till you see this on the background of the, oh my gosh. So, cause you were guaranteed, not that, that <laughs> you were guaranteed to get one <laughs> like that. So. Look hey. at this pearl, you guys. Dean, come check out this pearl. Look at this pearl. Oh, Look at the size of this pearl. Oh my god. Yeah, this and you guys is got a but how one. big that pearl is. Wow. That's insane. Wow. Uh, and we've been doing this many that years for so us to be like, you gotta see this. It takes I mean this is oh really, really it's such a great pearl. So aww. Aww. and they just got married on Thursday. The last time she pulled me over to see something that was twins. Yeah, so that's yep. another rare thing. That's a super rare pearl. This is so cool. Beautiful. So the salt um, is just a one-time cleaning and we use it to oh. just take away that final calcium or that buildup from the oyster. So we're giving it a good scrub and with pearls, let's get that salt cleared away, but you're going to be the very first one to hold your pearl today. It's honestly, sir, I think it's bigger. It's bigger. I, I really do. So you can feel there is a natural weight. So your rare pearl of love is right here. <gasps> it's heavy. That out. Yes, it is. That's the oh pearl jackpot. <laughs> All right, so you take take your hand first. You take your hand, have get some good natural oil and make a wish, okay, for your very rare pearl today. I want to see what size you got. <laughs> got it? All right, so place it here on the tray when you're ready. And so ranging from six and a half you have picked today an 8.25 to 8.5 millimeter oh pearl, which is not even like a half size difference for as big as they can get. Um, so what we do now, the next step is we're going to look for the birthmark, which is just mother nature. It can look like a little dimple sometimes or a little, you see it? So this is where we'll go ahead and do the, the piercing so that way your pearl is prepared. And if you guys want to meet me on the front showcase, you can see all the different yes. options. 